Hey guys, today I'm going to teach you how to hack pretty much any game you want on your Wii. To do this, you are going to need an SD card, the homebrew channel on your Wii, a Wii obviously, a computer, a code manager to store your codes, and probably like Gecko OS on your homebrew channel or Ocarina. I don't think it really matters. Okay, so what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to load up your code manager so I use this one I'll give you a link to it in the description and you're gonna want to grab some codes for any game you want an ideal place to find codes for pretty much any game is geckocodes.org you can just put your region in and put the letter it starts with in and it'll come up so let's put in like N for New Super Mario Bros. And down here it has New Super Mario Bros. Wii for US and PAL. Also, a gr another great place is Volderbeek. They they haven't they've only got five different types of games, but they've certainly got a big variety. In Mario Kart Wii, they've got over a hundred different codes. So it's a great place. Okay, so what you want to do is you want to find a code. So let me just grab one. Okay, so for the purpose of this video, I'm just going to use a small code. So I'm going to use a banana size modifier. So what this does is, as you can see in MDM Wii's video up there, you can see the, that the bananas are much bigger than they would usually be. So this increases the size. And yes, you are more likely to slip. Here are the codes. For PAL, you are either in Europe or Australia. For NTSCU, you are in America somewhere. And J, you are probably in Japan or China. So, right now he has the Europe and Australian version and the American version. So I'm just going to grab my version, which is the Australian version. So you want to copy that. And you want to have the game ID. So for Mario Kart Wii, for PAL users, you have RMCP01. If you are US, you have RMCE01. For Japanese, you have RMCJ01. And you can get game IDs from what I had before, which was on Gecko Codes. So it usually comes up right next to the game. So if you can see next to every game in brackets, it has some type of letters and stuff. So that's the game ID. So for Mario Kart Wii, I have RMCP01. Just put the game name in. Store the name. And now you want to put the code title in. So I'm just going to put in banana size mod. You want to click on it. Now you want to paste in your code. So it's pasted in. You can add. You can put more than one code type in. So you can add another code and so on. But it, yeah, so just so on. Then you click on export to GCT. It'll come up with that. Then you want to tick your box. You want to go export to GCT. But before you store it, you want to go to your SD card. You want to go new folder and make a folder called codes then you want to store it so it goes into your SD card so it's removable disk E for me store okay and look in here and there's the code okay so you can do this with many other games as well so pretty much every game um, so, yeah, so once that's done, you just want to put it into your homebrew channel, load it up with Gecko OS or something, and then, voila, it's done. Thanks for watching.